Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is day number five. Um, kind of been dragging my ass today. So, <clears throat> I just finally got up and uh, did my pull-ups like I was supposed to. I'm going to take my multivitamin and all my boring stuff that I showed you guys. Teeth and all that stuff. You always got to do that stuff. Um, even right now, like I know that I'm dragging my ass a little bit and I could be already on the street right now ready to roll but I'm not gonna do that you know I'm not gonna skip it because uh, it's for me and uh, it's very important to keep up with you you know what I mean so I'm gonna <clears throat> I'm gonna do all my boring ritual stuff you guys know now you should know by now so I'm gonna do all that and then uh, I'm going to hop over to a uh, fuel bay because it's time to get some fuel. I'm going to also show you guys this uh, cool thing that Loves has that uh, really can help you out <clears throat> and it's a tire pass station. And uh, I think it's pretty cool because while you're getting gas they come out and they uh, air up your tires in your truck and they, uh, they make sure that they're all good to go. That they're all Oh, my phone cut off there for a second because uh, low battery. But um, anyways, I was saying I'm gonna go over to this fuel bay and uh, I'm gonna show you guys all my uh, the cool stuff that Love's doing over there and uh, get gas and all that. Uh, anyway, so let's hop over there. All right, I just pulled in the bay here and I just filled up. You can see there, 130 gallons. Um, so I cleaned the windows, I checked the engine and everything, bled the air valves, and the uh, Loves guy came out and he checked the tire pressure on uh, my truck tires, which is really cool. Everything was good. Um, I figured it was, but uh, got to keep up with these tires, man. They're expensive as shit. So uh, everything's good to go. Truck's ready to roll. I just need to go pick up my receipts and stuff, and uh, I can show you. They even give you a printout of how your tires were when they inspected them for you and um, yeah so I'm just gonna go grab that I'll show you what that looks like uh, what else I'm gonna get a coffee while I'm in there yeah I'm ready to roll so let's do it alright I'm ready to roll in here and uh, grab my stuff um, just saw a group of guys on some crotch rockets taking off and uh, Reminded of me when uh, when I had my motorcycle and uh, made me wish that's what I was doing today. It's really nice weather out here, so it's perfect for riding because it's really sunny and dry and but not like nasty dry, you know, where it's gonna you're gonna feel gross, but it's just dry enough where it's it's got a cool to it, you know. So like if I'm sitting in my truck, my truck's off, yeah, it's gonna get hot, but if I'm outside my truck, it's like perfect. So it's like great for riding. <sighs> Like I said, guys, today I'm dragging ass, so I'm not like, run out the truck, do this, do that. I'm just kind of, meh. Meh. So I'm going to go in there. I guess it's definitely time for coffee. And I also had the uh, tire pass. What's oh, your name? Uh, Zach.
All right, so I got my tire pass here. Um, and my coffee. And you can see how they can read like how much air was in each tire and then how much tread is left on the tire. So you have a good idea of what's going on. So anyways, off to the truck. Oop. Well everybody, uh, it appears everything is ready to go. I just need to go drag my ass around and uh, start heading where I'm going. Yeah, over here. Um, so yeah, that's the uh, start of my day. Got some coffee, so I'm excited for that. Hopefully it'll help. And uh, so yeah, anyways, <clears throat> I'm just mumbling literally nothing right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and start uh, heading out of here. Got everything going for me. I don't see any reason not to leave, so I just need to go ahead and do it. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna head out of here. This is gonna be a really boring part. I'm gonna throw in another 700 miles, maybe more. We'll see. The weather's really good. Um, so you know, obviously, I don't I don't record while I'm driving because I just feel it's dumb. So. Uh, you guys won't see me for a while. Um, we'll just magically reappear in another <laughs> in another state and uh, continue this video. Bye. All right, so um, getting pretty close to the uh, end of the day here. I'm uh, still a little bit away from where I'm going to park for the night. Um, if I keep going at the pace I'm going, I'll probably be about anywhere between 50 and 150 miles away from where I'm delivering, which is kind of annoying because it's like, if things uh, speed up and I, I get like 50 miles out from the delivery destination, that's just obnoxious, you know? It's like you're right there, but you're just barely out of time. But uh, anyways, I stopped rest area here because I had to use a restroom and uh, wanted to eat some tuna and crackers and stuff and just kind of relax for a second. So uh, yeah, my uh, I got a couple different places in mind where I'm gonna stop and we'll see how close I can get to the uh, to the drop point. But uh, anyways, so that's just a little update. And, uh, yeah, so I'll, uh, fill you guys in as I go, and blah. So, see you later. Well, everybody, I got my, uh, I got some good mileage in. I'm pretty close to my next pickup. So, uh, anyways, um... When I get up, I'm just going to get ready and I'm going to drive about an hour and a half and uh, go deliver this load. And then um, I'm going to head back to the yard so I can park the truck and do all the paperwork and all that fun stuff. And uh, yeah, so that'll be fun. So I'm pretty close. Almost uh, almost done for the week. Um, I got a chargeable uh, vacuum cleaner. I'm gonna plug that in too because I like to clean my truck at the end of the week. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. I'm gonna do my regular routine and um, see you guys in some hours so we can finish this off. Bye!